Welcome to my channel. My name is Allison and today we are going to declutter and organize and clean overall just to improve my desk situation. So I have the Alex desk from Ikea behind me and I actually have another one that's like my vanity. This whole room is like considered my office but it's kind of nicknamed my hoarding room because it's always like the messiest spot in our apartment because it's just where things get dumped and left and then dealt with later. So the top of the vanity is the smaller size linen tabletop. It's from Ikea with an Alex 5 drawer that has all of like my hair, makeup, all that stuff. We're not gonna focus too much on that today. We're probably gonna tidy that up a bit and clean it up a bit. But the main focus today is on the guy behind me, which is the larger size linen desk, which is like the same thing. It's just like longer and wider with another five drawer from Alex that feeds a lot of TLC in it, like a lot, a lot. We're going to organize the drawers. We're gonna clean it up. We're gonna redecorate kind of the top of the desk because it's not, I'm not loving it. I'm not vibing with it. And all of my electronics are kind of piled up in a corner and I keep knocking over the mic and I just like can never find like where my iPhone can plug in and like my Apple watch charger is like hidden in the back. Like there's a lot of issues with it that I want to just like address and refresh and make better overall. So before we get into like the nitty gritty of like clearing out the stuff off the top of the desk, cleaning it down, reorganizing all, all of the good stuff in the video, I'm gonna take you on a quick tour of what we are working with. So this is the vanity desk that I was talking about. We're not gonna work on organizing this too much, but the top of it is just like a disaster. And it's some stuff that belongs in this room, some stuff that goes on the desk, some stuff that needs to find a new home. So we're gonna tackle cleaning all that today because a lot of that stuff is gonna end up in these drawers. And the big desk over here is what we're gonna focus on today on organizing and, and giving like a facelift to. It's the much larger linen desk. If you can tell back here, it doesn't quite cover the entire length of the Alex drawer, which is fine because like the door closes right here. So no one ever sees that. But I have an Alex five drawer that has all of my office supplies in here. So like quick grab stuff. This is probably the most organized drawer right here where I keep my pens and post-it notes. So this probably, I need to go through and get rid of some of this stuff because like I can't tell you the last time that I reached for like these kinds of pens. We need to go through and get rid of some of stuff because this drawer like struggles to close sometimes. This is a really bad drawer. I called it the electronics drawer because it has like everything in there. There's command hooks, there's a running watch, there's 16 calculators, an extra battery for my laptop, like portable chargers, Alexa, like smart plugs, like hot mess town in there. This is stationary, that's kind of organized, and this is just paper and stuff, and like my college diploma, like, I don't know what to do with that. And the top of the desk isn't that bad. I like hikey have a little garden situation going on here. Normally, I like that to look like this. Like, doesn't that look nice? Like little plants and a candle, and then I hide the tissue box in the back. I don't know if I should do something else with that. I have my like portable speaker that lives out here sometimes. I don't know if that should stay here, a lighter, this stuff, my planners, laptop. Over here, back behind it is like the mess of all the electronics, so like an external hard drive, my Apple Watch charger, my microphone always knocks over. This pen cup's a little bit like, not as cute as I'd like it to be, so maybe I like put some of that stuff in the drawer if I make room for it and have a smaller pen cup. This is also a bunch of just random like Bible studies, I don't know. I just wanna make this a little bit better. Now that I've been probably rambling for like five minutes, we're gonna get into the like actual meat of the video. And I think the first step is to give the room a good cleaning. Like, make sure that isn't as scary as it is right now. Okay, hopefully that was a pretty quick time lapse, but we cleaned off the vanity and then we also tidied up this little like reading corner and like this bar cart that like doesn't really go in here, but like it just lives in here. Don't talk about it. Just did a basic wipe down of the whole thing, put away things that go into the drawers, which is just like makeup in here, nothing terribly exciting. And I was doing Gossip Girl in the background through all of that. So I have more piles on this desk now, as you can tell, just things that were on the vanity that needed to go over here and just from other places. I think I'm gonna start with the drawers and tackle the part that I don't wanna do in this project, which is organizing these and getting rid of 
this stuff that I don't need because I'm kind of excited to like restyle the top of it but this doesn't excite me that much so let's do the hard part first can you see me I'm just gonna go through this let you guys do a time lapse on it I'm just gonna sort through what's like trash and maybe donations I have a goodwill bag going in my closet so if there's anything in here that's like new and in good condition that someone else could use better than I could I'll donate it to goodwill <laughs> Okay, we are off to a good start. This drawer is good. We have a pile of some trash in the corner, a notebook that I'm not gonna use. So I'm gonna send that to Goodwill. So this is kind of like our backup paper supply drawer plus storage for my diploma because I don't know what else to do with it. Next drawer. We are getting all of the fantastic camera angles for this. So this drawer is like our stationary. I actually just decluttered this drawer a little bit in the spring cleaning I did like maybe a week ago. I'll link that here if you wanna watch that. But I think I can go through and like rehome some of these things. I don't know. We'll see what we can do with this drawer. Okay, that's all that I'm gonna do in this drawer. But I mostly cleaned this out in that last video, so not much to do in here. Now on to the big kahuna, and I am not excited for this at all. Maybe I should, I have no idea what I'm doing. You know what, I'm gonna stop talking and I'm gonna just start organizing. All of this came from this one little bin and there's still all of this in this drawer. How do I have this much like random junk? I wanna just throw it all away even though I know I shouldn't. Like these calculators, when am I gonna need my financial calculator again? I don't know, probably still gonna keep it though. Oh, like old iPhones, Disney keychains, six pairs of headphones, three glue sticks, three rolls of tape. So I'm gonna quit complaining and I'm gonna accept that this is all my junk and own up to it and sort through it all like an adult. Okay, on the surface, this drawer may not look that different or that less like cluttered or chaotic because this bin is still really chaotic, but I don't really have another option to store all of this stuff in and I got rid of a bunch of stuff and I moved all the pens up to here to go through in a second, but I cleared out all of like the random junk so it's mostly electronics and backup supplies. My rogue command hooks are in here, a bunch of small cables that we need to still keep are here. I have a bunch of this gum, I think we're gonna find some more of it later in the desk so I'm gonna stack them here. I like this a lot. It is a lot more organized and a lot less chaotic and it won't get caught when I close it. So that's a huge plus. This one looks on the surface pretty organized, but I don't need all of these pens and they're pretty gross. A lot of them are Christians and they will have a better life somewhere else. And then a lot of these sticky notes need to be gone through. I don't know if I'm gonna keep these washi tapes. We'll figure it out as we go through this drawer. Okay, so we are mostly done with the organizing. There's a couple more things that I wanna change because that pen cup, I wanna move those pens into those drawers. So I don't know how that's gonna work out. And then there's also a ton of paperwork on the desk and just stuff in general. And some stuff from the drawers might come out as decor. Not sure about that yet. I think what I'm going to do though, because I am losing steam a little bit. I don't know, the three o'clock like drag is hitting me hard. Let me know down in the comments if you guys have that like three o'clock hits and like for some reason you are zonked out. And I've already had my second cup of coffee for the day, so I'm not letting myself have another cup. So I need to just power through this. We're gonna we're gonna work through this.
Okay, so I actually stopped the time lapses a little bit ago and I've just been playing around at the desk without filming it. And I don't know how I feel about this setup. I also can't decide if I wanna put the ears back up there. I have a gold pair but I think it's too like glam and I'm not like a glam person. So if I'm gonna do an ear, it'll be those back up on the corner. But the bigger dilemma is this magazine rack, stand, holder, whatever. I could fit my notebooks and my planners that I use regularly in there. That way like they don't always just sit on the desk, they have a place to go. But I don't want it in that corner, but I feel like this corner is now really empty and I don't love it on this side either. So I don't know what to do with that. I don't think this is what I want, but it's pretty close. I'm gonna keep playing around with it a little bit and see where we end up. Okay, I've played around with this a lot, honestly too much, like I'm way overthinking this <laughs> and it's barely even changed, but I think I'm really happy with how I have set up the top of the desk now. Ta-da! Also, ignore Gossip Girl. I'm starting from season two. This is the final Outlook. I decided no mouse ears. We're gonna be a little more mature for right now. So up here It's pretty much the same. I've got these three plants I took out the big anthropology candle because like this is a big white round thing And that was a big white round thing and it was like I don't know It was messing with my feng shui So I moved over this little picture frame that I stuck two little polaroids of Krishna and I in I have my coaster from anthropology My water is normally here too. Then underneath the computer you can see that polka dotted box That's my tissues and then all of these cords and then my microphones back there too And I just kind of pushed all the cords back so they're not as Hideous, like you can't really notice them while you're sitting up here. Then keyboard and mouse. This is like an Amazon mouse pad. I'm not a big fan of marble, so like don't know why I have marble here and marble there. I'm much more of like the natural vibes, like this kind of thing. So I might replace this at some point. I just don't know with what. And then over in this little corner, I ended up leaving the magazine rack here because I like the fact that I can stick my planners and notebooks in there that I use frequently and so they're not just sitting on the desk making it cluttered. So I decided to like bite the bullet and deal with not loving it for right now and putting it over there. And then with it against the wall, it almost like puts something on this wall, which helps out with the decoration so it doesn't feel like so empty on this side. And then I have this little mason jar thing with some pens and pencils. I edited down all of the markers and moved them into this drawer with the rest of the markers. And then I have these little baskets that are from Ikea. They come in a set of three, so I just stacked these two on top of each other and there's nothing in them right now. But if I ever need to expand storage, out into here, I can always just fill these guys up. I played around with the top drawers a little bit. So up here I keep scissors and tape and just like basic necessities in this little plastic bin that I've had forever. This is more like my self-care moisturizer bin. I've got hand cream, nail oil, lip balm, hair ties. This glass jar has post-it notes. Here's my portable speaker that I bring out into the family room every morning to do my workouts when I'm working out from home. And then just basic office supplies in the back. You've already seen this drawer. These organizers are from Target. They were like $2 for a set of four. I don't know if they have them anymore, but they come in different sizes, so and they're kind of like bendy and squishy. So I have different pens and markers and all that in there. I got rid of most of my washi tape. I just kept a couple that were kind of cute. I had two of them up here. I moved that second one to a different location. And then I got rid of some of my other sticky notes. And back here are just more like colored pens and markers because I have a problem. Down here I reworked this because it was hard to reach in and grab it because to grab into these drawers you stick your finger in kind of and pull out. And with this guy up against here you couldn't like get a grip on this. So I moved it around a little bit. I moved all my earbuds into this extra Target organizer that I moved down here. My gum is back there. See how I have a problem. And then I think these drawers stayed the same from when I first showed you. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching me make over declutter restyle barely my desk, make it a little bit more sophisticated, a little more balanced, a little more neutral, because I am a neutral Nelly, as you can tell probably. I am going to stop recording this video and take care of all these piles. I'm gonna put some stuff in a Goodwill bag and take that to Goodwill so other people can love things that I can't anymore. But 
Thank you guys for watching. I have a lot of other organization videos coming in soon. I bought those bins over there from Ikea with a bunch of other stuff that's going to be part of a big organization project. Actually, two different organization projects. The rest of that order is coming in tomorrow, fingers crossed. We can film that and get that video out for you guys. So stay tuned for a lot more home organization, styling, decorating content coming soon. And then once those videos go out, my husband and I are actually going to be moving from here pretty soon. So we'll have an entire new home to decorate, which is crazy to think about. So if you're really into these like home decor, organize it with me, moving vlogs, like subscribe and turn on notification bell so you don't miss any of those that are going to be coming out in the future. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.